Will Davis has leukemia. He's been battling the cancer since he was diagnosed in 2007. For him, giving up is not an option. Somebody's got to look out after him. It gives me a hope and a reason to get up for in the mornings. The 51-year-old cares for his family's farm and works a full-time job to secure some health insurance benefits. But the bills for his treatment keep adding up. Every time I see the doctor, I still almost have $200 worth of bills. Plus, my co-payment for just my um, chemo is $100 a month. The Angel Fund Foundation helps cover those costs. We can take that financial burden away from them and hopefully give them the hope and encouragement they need. Beth Morgan calls herself a miracle walking. She was diagnosed with multiple myeloma, a bone cancer, in 1998. When I was diagnosed, I was given a maximum of 33 months to live. 21 years later, she's made it her mission to help cover the medical expenses for patients like Davis. She and her family founded the nonprofit so patients can focus on their health. They can look forward to not so much what they're going to go through, but look forward to life. They provided more than $200,000 to more than 150 patients. Davis's mother says it's about more than just the money. It was a definite act of God. They are perfectly named Angel Fund. It's met my life. I mean, it's given me, given me life. Jenna Jordan, NBC6 News. Jenna Jordan, Fox 33 News.